Tukiachana na hayo sasa taarifa ambayo itaibua hisia mbalimbali swala la upangaji uzazi miongoni mwa wanaume limezua mdahalo mkali huku zoezi kubwa la upasuaji mishipa ya uzazi kwa wanaume likitarajiwa kufanyika hapa Nairobi Juma Rijalo mwanahabari wetu Elfas Lagat ana maelezo zaidi Daktari Charles Ocheng ni mojawapo wa wanaume ambao wameweza kukata mishipa yao ya kiume kama njia ya kupanga uzazi. Anatueleza kwamba japo mkewe hakuridhia mwanzoni, hana majuto wa kuweza kuchukua hatua hiyo. It is in 2008, less almost 10 years ago. And the main reason was um, we had had two children already and uh, but the method my wife was using uh, was giving us some health challenges. So that's why I decided to look for a doctor, which was very difficult to get a doctor to perform it for me. But I had to wait for a doctor who had gone to Ethiopia for some training. So when he came back after six months, I had my vasectomy. Ochengi visasa anampango wa kufanya harakati hiyo ya upangaji uzazi bila malipo kuanzia tare 23 hadi tare 26 mwezi huu katika kilini yake iliopo jijini Nairobi. The acceptance has not reached that level where you couldn't be able to do so much. I think uh, 100 is a fair number. So we expect um, men to come in from Monday uh, next week. That will be on the 23rd to the 26th. That will be on the Thursday. Wengi kati ya wakazi wa Nairobi wamekataa kwamba kamwe hawatajihusisha na operesheni hiyo ya kufunga mishipa ya uzazi. Male family planning, um, whoever introduced it went against the will and the thought of God. Because the thought of God is to allow us to fill the earth uh, uh, we are supposed to subdue, we are supposed to fill the earth. But now you see when you do a male family planning, you are reducing and you are refusing the continuity of God, the growth and the expansion of God. Wengine wanasema ni kinyume na maadili ya kidini, inaya amuru binadamu kuzaa na kujaza dunia. Miono mingi inazidi kuibuka kufuatia suala hili nyeti kwamba wanaume waneza kujiusisha katika tendo la kupanga uzazi kwa kuweza kufanya vasectomy. Hili ni jambo ambalo limezua mjadala mkali baina ya wakazi jijini Nairobi. Siku chache tu kabla ya shuguli hiyo kuanza jumatatu wiki ijayo. Elfos Lagat, KTN News, 